Question 16. What are the four distinct types of memory in 8051? Answer. Internal RAM. Special function registers. Program memory. External data memory. Question 17. Tell the addresses which are bit addressable. Answer. The bit addressable memory in 8051 is composed from 210 bits. Bit address space. 20H to 2FH bytes RAM equals 0. 0H to 7FH bits address. SFR registers. Question 18. What is LST file? Answer. This file is also called as list file. It lists the opcodes, addresses and errors detected by the assembler. List file is produced only when indicated by the user. It can be accessed by an editor and displayed on monitor screen or printed. Programmer uses this file to find the syntax errors and later fix them. Question 19. Explain DB. Answer. DB is called as defined byte used as a directive in the assembler. It is used to define the 8-bit data in binary, hexadecimal or decimal formats. It is the only directive that can be used to define ASCII strings larger than 2 characters. DB is also used to allocate memory in byte-sized chunks. The assembler always converts the numbers into hexadecimal. Question 20. What is EQU? Answer. EQU is the equator assembler directive used to define a constant without occupying a memory location. It associates a constant value with data label. Whenever the label appears in the program, constant value is substituted for label. Advantage. The constant value occurring at various positions in a program can be changed at once using this directive. Syntax. Label EQU constant value. Question 21. How are labels named in assembly language? Answer. Label name should be unique and must contain alphabetic letters in both uppercase and lowercase. First letter should always be an alphabetic letter. It can also use digits and special characters at comma underscore comma dollar. Label should not be one of the reserved words in assembly language. These labels make the program much easier to read and maintain. Question 22. Are all the bits of flag register used in 8051? Answer. The flag register also called as the program status word uses only 6 bits. The two unused bits are user definable flags. Carry, auxiliary carry, parity and overflow flags are the conditional flags used in it. One is a user definable bit and PSW.5 can be used as general purpose bit. Rest all flags indicate some or the other condition of an arithmetic operation. Question 23. Which bit of the flag register is set when output overflows to the sign bit? Answer. The second bit of the flag register is set when output flows to the sign bit. This flag is also called as the overflow flag. Here the output of the sign number operation is too large to be accommodated in 7 bits. For sign numbers the MSP is used to indicate the whether the number is positive or negative. It is only used to detect errors in sign number operations. Question 24. What are issues related to stack and bank 1? Answer. Bank 1 uses the same RAM space as the stack. Stack pointer is incremented or decremented according to the push or pop instruction. If the stack pointer is decremented it uses location 7, 6, 5, which belong to register bank 0. If a given program uses R1 then stack is provided new memory location. The push instruction may also take stack to location 0i.e. It will run out of space. Question 25. Explain JNC. Answer. It is a command used to jump if no carry occurs after an arithmetic operation. It is called as jump if no carry. Conditional jump instruction. Here the carry flag bit in PSW register is used to make decision. The processor looks at the carry flag to see if it is raised or not. If carry flag is zero, CPU fetches instructions from the address of the label. Question 26. Can port 0 be used as input-output port? Answer. Yes, port 0 can be used as input-output port. Port 0 is an open drain unlike ports 2, 3, 4. To use it as input or output the 10K OHM pull-up resistors are connected to it externally. To make port 0 as input port it must be programmed by writing 1 to all bits. Example, MOVA, hash 0 FFH. MOVP0 A Question 27 Which two ports combined to form the 16-bit address for external memory access? Answer Port 0 and Port 2 together form the 16-bit address for external memory. 
Sport Zero uses pins 32 to 39 of 8051 to give the lower address bits a D0AD7. Port 2 uses pins 21 to 28 of 8051 to give the higher address bits a 8A15. This 16-bit address is used to access external memory if attached. When connected to external memory they cannot be used as input-output ports. Question 28. Can single bit of a port be accessed in 8051? Answer. Yes. 8051 has the capability of accessing only single bit of a port. Here only single bit is accessed and rest is unaltered. Syntax. Set B X. Y. Here X is the port number and Y is the desired bit. Example. Set B P 1.2. Here the second bit of port 1 is set to 1. Question 29. Other than set B, CLR are there any single bit instructions? Answer. There are in total 6 single bit instructions. CPL bit. Complement the bit. Bit equals not bit. JB bit. Target. Jump to target if bit equal to 1. JNB bit. Target. Jump to target if bit is equal to 0. JCB bit. Target. Jump to target if bit is equal to 1 and then clear bit.